kids, Puppy Steve here, and as you know, we just love Five Nights at Freddy's and the Twisted Ones book. And if you're looking for any Twisted Ones action figures, well, unfortunately, they don't exist. Well, unless you go to Mexico, <laughs> ah, because in Mexico, they actually have Five Nights at Freddy's Twisted One bootlegs. Oh, and just check it out. They have four packs of figures, which contains Five Nights at Freddy's figures in their Twisted Ones form. <laughs> Oh man, we've got them, and they're super rare, and we're gonna reveal them here today. All right, so the first one we're gonna look at is Old Twisted Freddy. Oh man, I just checked this figure out. Boy, you can sure tell it's a bootleg because the details on the face and everything else is not as good as maybe like Funko. But, ah well, for a bootleg, this'll do because, well, there's no other Twisted Ones figures out there. So it looks like Mexico, for right now, has the exclusive on them. Ooh, from head to toe, this figure is super creepy. Ugh, I wouldn't want to see this guy at night. <laughs> ah, but just look at that sculpt. Ugh, gross. And ooh, look at that, his jaw comes off. <laughs> ah, look at that. Try to say something there, Freddy. <laughs> what, I can't tell what you're saying. <laughs> All right, let's put your jaw back on. Now, what were you saying? I said don't take my jaw off. Oh, ah, sorry there, Twisted Freddy. Ah, well, anyway, just check out this super cool figure. He's got a blank stare in his eyes. He's got a top hat, and, uh, ooh, he's got articulation all over the place. Well, that's a plus, uh, except for in his legs. Ah, boo, that's a minus. What? Ew, look at that hole in his chest. When I was reading the Twisted Ones book, I should have paid more attention to all the details inside because I didn't know Freddy looked like that. Well, this is a kind of cool looking figure, but of course, the one problem I do have with it is that well, they made him a light tan color. And I thought Twisted Freddy would be a little darker, like old Nightmare Freddy here. Aw, oh, man. Hey, why's your skin so light? Hey, I was left out in the sun for two weeks. What do you expect? Well, I guess that answers that. All right, well, moving on to the next figure, which is, ooh, Twisted One's Foxy. I thought Foxy was supposed to be coming out of a pile of dirt, like in the Twisted One Pop figure. Well, I guess it wasn't practical for the action figure, so I guess they made him just look like the regular Foxy from the head down. And of course, yep, it pretty much works. I mean, just look at those feet. Super cool, super creepy, and of course with the hook for a hand, yep, super scary. He's got the super sharp razor teeth, he's got the hook for a hand, and on back, uh, he's got this little nodule. I'm not sure what that's about, but uh, yeah, I guess I should finish reading the book before I comment any more on it. All right, the third figure we have is good old Twisted Bunny. And you know what? For being a bootleg, this one looks pretty darn good. I mean, we have the uh, jaw that's hanging off the first one there. We have his exposed body on this side. And look, there's articulation too. Gotta love that. And of course, you gotta love that they got the color right on this guy too. He looks just like Bonnie, but uh, more twisted. And of course, the last figure we have is the newcomer, Twisted Wolf. And ooh, just check out this guy. I'm gonna come get ya. Well, but not yet, we have to check you out. <laughs> and just look at that Twisted Wolf. He's got that super cool fangs in front. He's got his chest that's exposed. And look at that. Ooh, his mane and everything looks super creepy and super twisted. And you know what? If you put all four of these guys together, they look great. I mean, for being bootlegs, I mean, there's not too many negative things I can say about these. Other than they kind of smell like spray paint. <laughs> yeah. So I'm not really sure if they're safe to play with kids or not. Well, if you kids want some figures like this for your very own, well, I'm not really sure where to get them because I found ours on eBay. And of course, once you bid on it, sometimes the auction closes because all well, their bootlegs they are not supposed to be there. <laughs> so if you end up finding one of these sets of your very own, well, consider yourself lucky because they're kind of hard to find. All right, kids, well, there they are. The Twisted Ones bootleg figures from Mexico. Hey kids, please help out our Puppet Steve channel by subscribing to us because we're trying to get to 500,000 subscribers by the end of this summer. A new Puppet Steve store is here. And this summer, you can buy t-shirts and more. As always, thanks for watching, kids.